All right, I'm back home. Uh, here are my finds for today, um, except these finds, which I'll get to you later. Um, and then, uh, so anyway, today at Burbank, uh, besides these finds, which is, are the good stuff, um, I found trash over here, as you can see. Three boring old beer cans in the trash, and then a bunch of pull tabs. And I'm not sure what the heck this thing is. It's like part of a pen of some sort. As for the pull tabs and crap, it's also gonna go adios into the old trash bin. And now, um, this piece of foil, which I found it rather <laughs> both funny and obscene, looks like a mini dildo as you can see it looks like someone tried to make a penis out of a piece of foil or it might have been part of some porno art or something like that but I might be keeping that just cause just to throw jokes with my friends so yeah that's legit um okay starting off with the dimes I got um actually before I even go to this side I want to show you some finds that I dug up before while well, my camera was broken and I finally got to fix it so starting with the best one which is a um Frazen's pizza uh token and I actually have been to this pizza place in Ellensburg and it's a I don't know if you can see that but um it's a pretty neat token um for games obviously and it even has a f phone number on there um yeah, I haven't been to that place in a while, but they have a really good pizza. I like their pepperoni. So yeah, it's a good one. And then 20 cents in dimes, 1982 and 84. Um, $1.25 in quarters, which actually make it a dollar since... Usually with Clyde quarters, I spend them since I really... Uh, to tell you the truth, I found so many of those that eventually my whole bin of clad eventually got in my way and got pretty annoying so I decided to use it for money since it's definitely has no value and also just is a normal quarter but I am going to keep this 1974 bent up quarter which must have been bent up by some lawnmower because I was at this park in Redmond it was uh what was that part um it was I think it was right next to the coast, uh, the National Guard's military base. Uh, yeah, I forgot the name, but if it comes, I'll mention it to you later. But um, um, yeah. So, and then the pennies, nothing old. The oldest two are 1973, right over here. So nothing special there. And now for the finds today. Uh, first of all. I might remember this. It's the uh, old piece to what looked like a hanging flower pot. And then um, I got this uh, remains of a harmonica. I can still hear it playing. That's how the metal detector sensed it because I could hear it playing. But yeah, this one's pretty old. Unfortunately, being, being a total artard, I nicked it. You see that shine? Here. See that shiny spot right there? I nicked it pretty good. That sucks. And then I got 20 cents in dimes, 1986, 1990, uh, 90, 2000, and 1980. Crap. 50 cents in quarters, 1980 and 1969. Sorry. Uh, right over here. And then pennies. 1983, 2002, 78, 1978, 1988, um, 1982, 19, I mean, 2000, and another 1982. And then these were the good pennies, uh, 1966 Canadian. Crap, I don't know if you can see that. My camera's pretty blurry, but, um, 1966, and then, 
1963 D Memorial Cent, so I was expecting to find a wheat after finding that old 1919 wheat, which I actually, um, along with my other coins that I collect, or have collected over a long time, um, crap, ah, uh, here, I even stuck a little slip in it thing that indicates the date, which is, which is, um, March 8th, 2009, so almost a month ago, and then here it is again, that beautiful 1919 wheat penny, sorry you can't see it, see the date, because it's such blurry graphics, but we'll see if I can post, uh, post photos of my finds on YouTube instead of just filming it, because I know you guys can't see it. Which sucks, but anyway, that's that's the the oldest penny I found there, which I was really happy about. Um, and so yeah, and then this is the oldest penny for today, or the two oldest that I am definitely gonna keep. And music to my ears. I tried playing this thing, and all I got was dirt in my mouth. So <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it of my finds. Uh, and thank you again, LA Digger, for your tips, and uh, along with Eula and Scorpio to you for um, for posting awesome comments, and uh, look forward to filming it filming again when I go back to digging. So, um, yep, have a good hunt, and uh, catch you later. Adios.